Developing news now from Plainfield this noon, an investigation is underway after a 47 year old man was found dead in a camper. This happened on Community Avenue right by a Staples Fulfillment Center. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Aya Galal has the very latest now on the investigation and reaction from those who live in the area. Aya? None of my friends are safe. I have to walk my friends to the bus stop every morning. Just to make sure they're okay. <coughs> it, it's tough. Neighbors in fear after a man was killed in a camper on Community Avenue. That's not something that Plainfield needs out on its streets, especially as peaceful as this community is. Police say 47 year old Keith C. Coolidge Jr. was pronounced dead at the scene. Connecticut State Police and Plainfield Police canvassed the area, searching for evidence as they tried to piece together what happened. Authorities arrested 37 year old Keith T. Coolidge and charged him with violating a protective order. Court records show he's known to law enforcement. Back in March, he was charged with threatening and disorderly conduct after police say he banged on the windows of homes in the neighborhood with a machete. And I can't say that I was extremely shocked. I mean, he's been in trouble for a couple things, so, and he's gotten out. And this homicide has neighbors on edge even more now. I hope that we can one day look forward to seeing the peaceful streets of Plainfield again instead of the rattled skeleton of what we have right now. Police say a suspect has been identified in the homicide, but they haven't specified who just yet or a motive. Now the office of the chief medical examiner is performing an autopsy on 47 year old Keith Coolidge Jr. They will determine the cause and manner of death. We will keep you updated on any new information we learn. Reporting in Plainfield, Aya Galal, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.